I don't want to say it's manifesting. I don't want to say it's attraction. It's just a state of being. When it's a state of being, it's a state of flow. I got a mantra about two months ago in the middle of the night. I woke, I just woke up with it completely right in, in my face. And so I came down and I wrote it on this piece of cardboard. So here's, can you guys read that? Mm -hmm. Be love, be free. That's it. So, and there's a feather, but that's another story. Um, <laughs> so, you know, it's be love on the in breath and be free on the out breath. <clears throat> and you were asking what, like, what's people's practice? Like, the, you know, I don't have a lot of time to do a lot of routine. I've been trying to get to the gym for three, three days a week. And that's, that's good if I can do that. I don't have a yoga med practice much. I don't have a meditation practice much. That is my mantra. I can sink into that all day long, anytime. And it shifts everything. I've shared it with 30 people already. And every one of them talks about how powerful it is. And it, it doesn't matter what state of mind you're in and what energies around you. When you fall back into a state of, I want to be love and I can be free. When I be love, I be free. And it's free of whatever stuff's going on, whatever's happening. So January was really good month. February has been just nickel and dime stuff and dealing with carryovers of trying to get jobs. I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to pay my bills. There's only a week left. I couldn't sleep at all last night. Woke up with a real anxiety this morning. And then I just said, okay, this has been controlling me for about a week now. I can't take this anymore. I literally finished up the job yesterday. I have no work for the rest of the week. I'm trying to figure out how to cover my phone bill and my mortgage by the end of the month. So I just sat and got it back into this mantra. And I'm like, I have to be proactive. I'm going to get into this mantra and just go. And so then there was a lady I was supposed to do this electrical job for like three months ago. And I got real busy. I called and left a message, but she didn't answer. I just left a message. There was another job I did windows for, but they wanted me to rewire their, their trailer. Nobody was home, sent a text, left a message. And then, um, what was the third one? Another job I went to, and I thought the guy was going to hire me on the spot. But he said, no, I have to go to the committee. It's a commercial job. He said, I have to get it approved. I'll let you know Monday. So part of me started to come up and get an anxiety again. I said, oh my gosh, that's three jobs. And I didn't get one of them again. So I just went back into the mantra. I was like, no, shift it, shift it, shift it. Within 45 minutes, the lady called back, wants me to do the job tomorrow. It's like a $400 job. The, the camp, the trailer people called and said, we'll be here after three. I met with them at four. The guy's like, look, it's electrical. I don't care what it costs. I just want it done fixed. I said, you want a price? No, you just give me a bill. I'll pay it. I want it fixed. Right. That was in the, so within three hours that all the work came back in again. Yeah. And it was all in a shift of me getting in the proper mindset of be love, be free. Yep. If you're in yep. a state of love, all your stress, all your bullshit, all your worries, all that crap goes away. It's a pure state. And it's yes. like, I don't want to say it's manifesting. I don't want to say it's attraction. It's just a state of being. When it's a state of being, it's a state of flow. And that's what I'm, that's my realization in the last four months. And it's yes. really because of this mantra.